I'm bringing to you IPC's technical question of the week. My name is David Bergman. I am Vice President of International Relations for IPC. Uh, this question comes from one of our members and it specifically relates to component leads, through-hole component leads, mounted through a common conductor. And the condition uh, exists that there was a solder bridge between these two uh, two leads mounted through this common conductor. And the question is, is this solder bridge between these leads acceptable? To answer this question, you have to look at two paragraphs of IPC's acceptability standard, IPC A610, paragraphs 5262 and 1426. 5262 addresses bridging, and this is what exists in the uh, company's uh, question. There is a solder bridge between two component leads. So if you look at the defect statement, there's two statements. A solder connection uh, across conductors that should not be joined, and the solder has bridged to adjacent non-common conductor or components. Both of these conditions don't apply. The uh, Obviously the two leads or had intended to be joined in the fact that they are mounted through a common conductor. Uh, and then the second statement, it's talking about non-common conductors, so that also doesn't exist in the condition. So while this does address the acceptability or the not acceptability of bridging, it doesn't adequately address the question. So you have to look at 1426 where the condition has not been specified. So all of the other comment uh, or the discussion in 610 addresses non-common conductors being defective. So it says uh, in the uh, 1426 conditions that aren't specified as defective or as a process indicator, which as this is the case in the, with this question, may be considered acceptable unless it can be established that the condition affects user defined form, fit, and function. So 610 says it's acceptable, but check your customer requirements to be sure. That's this uh, week's technical question of the week. If you have one you'd like to send in, please send it in to answers at ipc.org.